Andre Onana responds to David De Gea message as Rio Ferdinand reconsiders stance. As Garnacho's devious move helps Onana save penalty, Rio Ferdinand believes Andre Onana's dramatic penalty save against Copenhagen can kickstart his Manchester United career. Onana produced a stunning save to deny Jordan Larson from the spot to earn Eric Ten Hag sign a priceless Champions League victory at home to the Danish champions. It comes after it Ferdinand had previously compared the Cameroonians' era strewn start at Old Trafford to that of David De Gea 12 years previously. The Spaniard was the long-term number one for United but had endured a difficult opening few months in which he adapted to English football. Ferdinand told his five podcast earlier this month, after Onana was disappointed in the goal conceded against Brentford, he should have made the save. In training, he probably makes that save every day. I saw a quote from Peter Schmeichel, who spoke to him and told him not to let Man United get to you. At the moment, there are nerves that are in there because of the mistakes. A lot of people are asking if he can recover. Ferdinand then added, of the comparison to De G's early days, I was there when De G came. He was obviously younger but he didn't start well, you know. I think in his first 10 games or so, the numbers are similar to Onana. If you were to speak to Onana himself, I think he would say, this is not the start I wanted. This is no way near the level I am used to performing at and this is not the standard required at Manut so I need to buck up my ideas. Despite his error against the Bees, Onana produced several fine saves in that match and United ground out a hard-fought 2-1 victory. The Cameroonian has now backed that up with back-to-back -back solid displays and victories, including his memorable penalty save against Copenhagen. Pundit Paul Scholes told TNT Sports after the match, believing the moment would be a major shot in the arm for Onana, he became a hero. It will do him the world of good. That drew concurrence from Ferdinand who believes that can be the moment that properly starts the goalkeeper's career at Old Trafford. This could change his season and I hope it does confidence-wise, Ferdinand explained. I hope he grows now. This is massive for him getting confidence now and he can go from strength to strength. All players need that and I'd like to think this is the one. United boss Ten Hag said of Onana after the win over Copenhagen, Andre had a good game. He made a brilliant save just after halftime too. He showed personality. He knows what his skills are and he didn't match his skills. In other news, Alejandro Garnacho's devious move and Eric Ten Hag's reaction as Man United secured crucial win. Alejandro Garnacho did all he could to aid Andre Onana's penalty-saving efforts as Manchester United secured three points for the first time in this season's Champions League. Copenhagen had the chance to thwart them late on at Old Trafford when they were awarded a spot kick four minutes into injury time. The Danes would have left Old Trafford with a point had Onana not produced a big save late on, but that was only after Garnacho made every effort to scuff up the penalty spot. Whilst the players remonstrated with the referee, the young Argentina wandered up to the spot and repeatedly dug his boots into the ground, attempting to make Jordan Larson's job that much harder, and so it proved. It meant that Harry Maguire's second half-header would end up being the match winner with Onana the late hero. Both men have copped flack this season but came up trumps in Manchester as the team put defeats to Bayern Munich and Galatasaray behind them. Eric Ten Hag opted to spend just shy of £50 M to land Onana's signature in the summer, moving David De Gion in the process but the Cameroon international has made several notable errors, calling the transfer into question. The Dutchman though has stuck by his new signing and he repaid that faith on Tuesday night. He said, I know how good he is and the skills he has. At United, you have to show it every game, having the right focus and mindset. If he has that, he will perform. I think it's very important for him. Of course, he had some criticism but now he saves the points for the lads. It was a brilliant save just after halftime also. United will play Copenhagen in the Danish capital next up before a clash with Bayern and a daunting trip to Turkey. Ten Hag has made it clear that his side need at least six points if they are to make the knockout stages of the Champions League, something they've done just once in the past four seasons. We have to go from game to game, he said. Today, we have seen there are no easy games. Copenhagen were playing well, organized. The next game is against them so, if you don't play your levels, you don't go far against them. If you want come through, you have to collect points. We need at least two wins more and the next game, we have another opportunity. If you enjoyed the video make sure to smash the like button and make sure to subscribe to Man United Hub to get all the latest updates.